So, I have a uh, family, well, I have in-laws and other family asking for litter bikes. Not a problem, I'm happy to build them. Problem is that all of my rigs run off these batteries. And all my direct family, the, the members who want one of these rigs, all use Milwaukee, I use Milwaukee, no big deal. I already made the adapter for these. But my in-laws do not. They use Bosch. So to make this work, which is still an 18 volt battery, we gotta make new adapters. Let me show you. So these right here, the little blue pieces, are this, the little spades that I have cut out that I use to make the battery adapters. Pretty simple thing. It's just a cut out of some stainless steel, <clears throat> and then I make all the rest of it. Let me show you how I drawn up as far as the actual adapter goes. So we can see our spades here on the back, and these channels, that's a six millimeter channel to run the number 10 cable through. And then on the other side here, we see our groove, which matches the groove that's on our battery. At least we hope it does. We haven't printed one of these out yet. And you push it in there and then it locks into the spades. And this little piece here on the top is the locking mechanism that is on these batteries. But I think we're getting there. Now something interesting on these rigs that I'm building since I'm only going to use one battery, I don't have to mount them on either side. But I do need to try to make them, you know, last as long as possible. So we're going to have to mount the battery at an angle of about 45 degrees to keep the weight as centered as possible. And these are going to go right over the front bumper on both rigs. So on both of them, we're going to have it about 45 degrees. And this one here, we're going to have to adjust the mount to make it easier to release because... The ladies who are getting this don't don't necessarily have a lot of hand strength so we're gonna probably cut that way down to make it super easy to release that battery of course the weight is probably going to keep it in place anyway they're not going to use these things for any type of speed they want to use them around the garden to get in and out of there and uh feed chickens and stuff like that so that's what we're doing designing battery mounts and we are printing the parts for the rigs right now. Both will have the rear steer assemblies. And we've already got the pack out mounts ready to go. Good time.